How goes everything, my friends? This is Nasal the Talking Nose, and we're off to City of Vil Vilcabamba in Tomb Raider 1. It's the second level in the game, and second part of Peru. In Tomb Raider, er, there, are four, there are different locations to go to countries. Anyway, we're going to get out the shotgun and kill these wolves. It might take some damage. I could have been further away to take less damage. Anyway, let's get the next wolf. We got the second wolf. I think yep, animals are easy to kill with the shotgun. And anyway, we got the fourth wolves. You can kill things quickly with the shotgun. Anyway, we got we got four wolves. We have to get might be another one. I do leave. That's it. I missed. And I got the next wolf. Now I got the wolves. There are four. There are five wolves. Yeah. And now that we got the wolves, we can. Anyway, let me check over here. I believe there would be a save game crystal. Also a grizzly. Actually a grizzly bear instead. We got the grizzly bear. Goodbye. He's dead. He's. He's, he's dead. He smoked now. And look at that onion. Anyway, over here there's a short health pack. Which is why we went in here. This is a haystack here. There are two doorways. And there's a stable here. And that's just it. It's a horse stable. Now we go back under... Now I go through the water, I mean. I mean, through the water. Here we go. There are two secrets to get when we go through here. First, we're going to take the la the right and the left. If you do this, if anyway, if you do the left first, I'll tell you about I'll tell you about that when I get there. First, we're going to get the lever er, and pull it. Flip the lever. Just flip that lever. And we open that door. Secret one. That's how I'm gonna do this. Now we can go back under here. Don't take too long, we'll run out of breath and drown. Oh, no. oh. Anyway, when you start to drown, you'll lose some health. Anyway, you'll have to never mind. There's gonna be cold water. That which which does it does bigger when you get cold water. You lose your health quicker in cold water, which is in Tomb Raider 3, of course, in, a in Antarctica levels. Anyway, there are- look at those snake bushes. Four. Those dragon bushes. There's a dra- the dragon- there's a dragon- the dragons appear in Tomb Raider 2, of course. Anyway, we now have one secret. We got- we got the secret, which now means we have four secrets in the game. And this secret- this secret contains Magnum clips along with a short health pack. Now let's get the fuck out of here. I love the designs and the Tomb Raider designs. Anyway, we're going back under the water. Here we go under, we're diving. And there are a couple of, I might, sometimes I might record until I get to a save game crystal. Because it might take over 10 minutes to record, like I've been telling you, my, my phone can only go up to 10 seconds. Anyway, we're gonna get the next secret, which is another lever. Now we to get we to get the next secret we have to flip another lever. Wow, two secrets in a row. To get some to get the two secrets you have to flip some levers for each secret. Anyway, we open this trapdoor, and there's another secret. This looks like a hay sta horse stable. And we anyway we got another secret. This secret contains a short health pack, and that's it. And I think it looks like that's it. Now let's pull the switch to get the fuck out of here. If you do this first, ignore the switch and get the next secret on that other side. This is the best way to do it. Order. It doesn't matter which order. It takes the same amount of time. Anyway, we're gonna go through that that room. Oh, we need to pick some things up. Okay, so here we go. Look at that clothesline, hang clothes hanger, and looks like a, a hanging of clothes, a clothes rack. Look at that. Anyway, try try to do the jump just right when you're over here. And there we did it. The music is playing. Wow, this music sounds religious. 
Sounds religious. Whoa, we made it there. I can't believe we made it. I didn't think we'd make it because over here there's a long health pack. I it's a good thing. I wow, that's a wow. It, sh it sure is a relief that we got that we got the long health pack. Now I can move on. Let's push this thing through. Push it like three times. Look at that seas, mirrored seas. And we need to push it four times, actually, not three times. Look at those hand marks are where you push it. Now I can see the hand marks there. Five, actually. Five spaces you need to push it. Five. And in this room, there's a bigger stable. This room, um, um, you need to pick up the gold idol and the silver key. Let's get those two. Wow, look at this room. This big room with lot gold pot of gold. And I got the gold island and the silver key. And now we can climb up and save our game. The save game crystals I, I was telling you, like I've been telling you, the save game crystals work as checkpoints. Anyway, we just got that bat. I forgot to tell you there was a bat coming in. And check for something else. Another bat. And here's a long health pack. Pick up the long health pack and kill the bat. Now we should use a short health pack. I think we should use a short health pack. And we he's used a short health pack. And look at this, look at that. Pot. Money pot. Look, wow, this room sure is big. This sure is a nice level. Looks like a I think it's like a this this level sure like looks like an Indian village. It reminds me of the native village. It reminds me of, of the fortress. It reminds me of the native village walls in Crash Bandicoot 1. Like the Great Gate in Native Fortress. It's kind of like the Great Gate in Native Fortress in Crash Bandicoot 1. But bigger. Anyway, I'm going to save my game right here. Because my, I, I recorded for like over 7 minutes. So, And this has been Nasal the Talking Nose. This has this has been na this was Nasal the Talking Nose in the first part of City of Vilcabamba, and I'll see you in the next part of City of Vilcabamba. See you there, friends. See you there.